I think everything's on the table. Whatever makes the Raiders better, I'm all for. And when I say I'm a go-getter, meaning whatever it takes to win, whatever it takes to get the best player to make our team the best, uh, that's what I want to do, and that's what I like to see us do. Um, Tom Telesco you know, has a lot more experience in the drafts than myself. I'm going to lean on him and his expertise on what we should do. And if it's the right fit and that guy there that we want is a Raider and he fits the Raider culture in our way, then we'll go get him. I know you can't give away your, uh, your evaluation, but there are some pretty good quarterbacks in this draft. Um, what's it been like now being a head coach to be able to assess that position? What, do you, what have you seen so far from this, uh, from this group? Yeah, it was good. Going at the combine, these pro days, getting around these uh, prospects, they're all ultra competitive. And that's what I like about them. You know, they all, you look at them, there's a few quarterbacks that got over 50 plus starts. There's some guys that, you know, three and done and one and done, you know, for that for that matter. Um, but what you're looking for is a leader. You know, you look at somebody that wants to come in, like I was asked earlier, you know, to come in that room and be competitive, give us that edge. And again, if it's a rookie, if it's Aiden, if it's Minshew, if it's Brown, you know, we're going to put the best player out there that gives us a chance to win. you see when you were with him this type of a rise or potential out of him? Yeah, I thought he'd be a Heisman winner. I did. That was my recruiting pitch to him. I just thought it would be where I was at previously. Do you think his game could translate to the NFL? If you win a Heisman, most likely, you guess, you know. Um, when you're looking at you look at Jaden and all these quarterbacks, you know, extremely talented. One thing about him that I think separates the rest is his ability to run. He can run, run. You know, when you can run like that in the SEC and put up those kind of numbers, uh, I think that translates very well. You think he can bulk up for the pros, or does he need to? Um, I think he's just let you know, nature take its course. You know, I mean, obviously he's been doing it as a slim athlete throughout his whole career. So I think just with, you know, being the nature of a man, you'll get bigger as you go along. So he'll be fine. You were saying the best quarterback for you is going to be playing. How do you as a de developing a rookie quarterback is always a challenge. How do you see that helping a guy to evolve into a league? Is rushing him, is playing him? quickly rushing him is you need to get the mistakes out of the way how do you kind of view yeah I think it all depends on the quarterback we get and, and who that guy is I mean do you want to throw him to the fire no uh, you, I don't think that's been the best way I played with a guy like Eli Manning first pick overall didn't play until like week eight or nine his rookie season didn't become a starter until year two so a thousand ways to skin a cat uh, we'll do what's best for the player and ourselves going forward and we'll really just let it play out I can't really answer that question now to be accurate. Antonio, what did you 